All right, YouTube, part two. Um, within five minutes of the last video, I had a dislike, and uh, you know, not that it bothers me. What what bothers me is that the person who disliked it wouldn't even explain why they disliked it. It would be nice to hear from somebody to hear them try to lie to themselves for once in the comment section. That would be awesome um, to see them try to convince themselves that they are right rather than just disliking something that hurts because the truth hurts and the fact that you have bought the lies for your entire life that sucks it sucks to even admit that but you know what I've gotten to a point in my life where I'm not gonna lie to myself uh, once you get to that point you, you can kinda start seeing things for what they are you know nobody had a choice I've already done this nobody had a choice on where they were born and for you to sit here and claim that you have a right to something that you inherited simply by falling onto the planet wherever you landed, um, that's crazy. To me, that's insane. Uh, if, I, if I could have been any other species, if I, if I could just go back and, and say, please let me be something else, I would have gladly picked a bird or a squirrel or a deer. At this point, it doesn't even matter. You could have made me pond scum. Because the animal kingdom has more sense than humans um, when it comes to freedom. <sighs> a bird flying from Canada to Mexico does not have to show an ID, does not have to ask permission, does not have to explain why he's traveling to that destination. I would have much rather been born an intelligent species rather than the most stupid species on this planet that is the human being this is why I have very few friends this is why I do not talk to very many people because I just cannot stand the stupidity uh, that surrounds the human species when it comes to what you claim is freedom you are not free you have painted yourself into a corner of the earth and you claim that it is your land Meanwhile, somebody's trying to tell you that you own the entire planet, and you hate them for that. You, you dislike somebody telling you that this planet is yours, and you are agreeing with the idea that you should have painted yourself into a freaking corner and put borders up. That's all you've done. I want to freely travel, like all the other species. I'm tired of asking permission to do any freaking thing, to cross the freaking street. You know, I bet the animal kingdom gets together and uh, they talk about us like we talk about them, that we talk about them like they're inferior to our intellect. I'm sure they have the same conversation. They probably look at us as, as a bunch of walking retards. Stop complying. And one more thing I want to add and hopefully this will be the end of the immigration thing because it's to me it's a non-issue to me it's just something that people are talking about for no freaking reason but um, you shipped the guns to Mexico and I'm not saying you I'm talking about the US government shipped the guns to Mexico now these cartels have all kinds of crazy weapons and you want to blame the Mexicans for wanting to get the hell out of Mexico I don't get it problem reaction and you want to be the solution. I don't get it. Instead of condemning these people to die because you have shipped guns with your tax dollars to them and into their uh, cartels, instead of condemning them to die and live in that, you should be glad to have them give them a hand, pull them out. I don't care. Feed them, clothe them, whatever. Food, <laughs> uh, food is a natural right. Water is a natural right. Land is a natural right. Nobody needs permission for any of that. Uh, anyways, thanks for listening, guys. Hopefully, hopefully, this is the last I'll ever talk about this. It's annoying.